The opinions expressed in this video do not represent YouTube, associations, agencies, or any particular individuals. Some explicit content may occur in this or future presentations. Viewer discretion may be advised, but ignored if you're into that thing. Come on, you fuckers think that just because a guy reads comics he can't start some shit? I'll fucking take all you want! What's going on, peeps? I'm the Big Bad Wolf Bad. This is another edition of Comic Book Corner. We're gonna switch it up a little bit. I'm gonna do like a battle royale. I'm gonna choose two random characters, and we're gonna basically tell ya who'd win the fight most of the time. I'll give you a brief rundown of their powers, how strong they are, why they would win, and then I'll also tell you there's a possibility this other guy could win depending if he finds out the weakness, if he figures it out. So let's just dive right into it. We've got Daredevil versus Wolverine. Alright, now Daredevil. Due to a chemical spill when he was a child, entered his eyes, he became blind. All his other senses became super. He has a built-in radar sense. If you've seen the new Daredevil show, they do a great job of how he can see. He actually can see, just not like you and me. Um, expert martial artist. He's been training since he was a child. Uh, probably around like Olympic gymnast level athlete. And then uh, add into uh, all the fact all his other senses are you know, super enhanced. Um, now this also works against him because a very loud sound can disorient him. A very foul odor can, you know, mess with him obviously because it's so intense he can pass out from it actually. Or he could use something that, you know, would weaken him, like some kind of poison or something that he wears that he couldn't smell that's odorless that would, you know, cause him harm or something. Something along that line. Now he's probably not going to have to worry about that with Wolverine. Now, Wolverine is a mutant with the ability to rapidly regenerate. So any damage you do to him, he's going to regenerate. As long as he's not knocked out, he's going to regenerate. Uh, he's got bone claws that are laced in adamantium. It's a fictional metal that's indestructible, near indestructible. There's been a couple characters that break broken adamantium. There have been people from the future who can just you know, manipulate like matter, and then there's just people like the Incredible Hulk who just can physically break it because they're so strong. So, again, Wolverine doesn't have to worry about this. Daredevil's strong. He's not that strong. He also has enhanced senses. Maybe not to the degree of Daredevil, but I'd say they're probably on equal terms. Now, the another thing that Wolverine has going for him is he can go to a state called his Feral Rage where he doesn't feel pain. And he just, you know, doubles his strength, his speed, all that stuff, and he just basically goes crazy. Psychics can't, you know, read his mind because he doesn't even know what he's going to do. So that could work for him. It could work against him, especially against somebody like as skilled as Daredevil. Who do I personally think is going to win? I'd have to say probably Wolverine. Nine, no, about seven out of ten times. Wolverine, just with the healing factor, it's hard to put Wolverine down. Now, Daredevil is an expert martial artist. He does know certain styles where he can pressure point him. So, hit a pressure point, that side part of the body goes dead. Even with his regenerative healing factor, it's going to take a little bit. Daredevil can get a good punch in or add another maneuver that can knock Wolverine out. So, I'd say about 7 out of 10 times Wolverine fights Daredevil, Wolverine's going to win. Got to remember, too, Wolverine's a couple hundred years old, so he has all this battle experience. So, that's going to play another factor into it. I mean, most times you see Wolverine, though, he fights like an animal. He doesn't think, even with all this experience. Like, he's a samurai. He's done ninjas. He's done everything. It's hard to say what he has and what he hasn't done, but he's done everything. So, I give it to Daredevil. Daredevil could probably take him down three out of ten times. But um, Wolverine, probably not, you know, seven out of ten times is going to win. Just, he's a good fighter. He's strong. Uh, that healing factor is what really does it for him. And, I mean, the adamantium skeleton... It's hard to take somebody down. I mean, this is a guy physically who can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Hulk. I mean, that says a lot. Wolverine goes up against a lot of the big hitters in the Marvel Universe. But um, skill-wise, Daredevil's probably about as equal. Um, but yeah, no, Wolverine takes it. I'm sorry. Uh, if you disagree with me, leave me you know, a comment down below. Let me know why I'm wrong, or if you agree with me, or if you think maybe it'd be 50-50 or something like that. So just leave me a comment down below. And as always, like, subscribe, share. I'm signing off. This is my combo corner. I'm the Big Bad Wolf, Benny. See you next time.